More than a dozen Little League players from across the country came to South Williamsport today for the annual Home Run Derby. Now these players are not part of the World Series, but they're certainly good enough to be in it, that's for sure. WBRE 28, WIOU 22, Eyewitness News reporter Cody Butler joining us live from the complex with more tonight. Cody. Nick and Candace, good evening. With the way in which they hit, I'm surprised they are not playing here at the World Series, but today was about the best of the best when it comes to home runs in both baseball and softball. 16 Little League players, including baseball and softball, from across the country took part in the annual Home Run Derby. It was awesome. It was like the coolest thing of my life, and I hope to do it again sometime in the Juniors Home Run Derby. Montoursville, Pennsylvania, Noah Kirby. Noah Kirby of Montoursville was one of eight baseball finalists in the country, the furthest player from Honolulu, Hawaii. Our league wasn't doing it, so we went down to the Williamsport one, and I hit 61, and then I made it to Kansas, and then made it to here. Yeah, I'm gonna put some stickers on it. With markers, stickers, and ink daubers, younger Montoursville Little League players crafted signs ahead of the Derby. What does your sign, sign say? Let's go, Lil Poppy. His nickname is Lil Poppy because he hits donners all day. Liam Lucas says Noah has been hitting home runs for years, getting his nickname from David Ortiz, AKA Big Poppy. I always knew that he would be amazing at it. I just didn't know he would make it this far. Eyewitness News asked family and friends of the players if they got what it takes to hit a home run. Brody, do you think that you could hit it over the wall? Yeah. How come? I don't know, I just think I have the power. Uh, I've hit it 220, so I think I could probably hit it five more feet, so. Do you think you could keep up with these sluggers? Uh, when I'm their age, probably. Now, per Little League International, I can't share the results of the Derby or how Noah did, but it will air ahead of the championship game, which airs this Sunday. So, Nick and Candace, I have to ask you the same question that I asked the kids. Do you think you could hit it over the fence? I would like to think I could. I was, you know, back in the Stone Age when I played. I was, I was pretty good, but it's hard to tell from that distance. It's definitely you know? difficult. Yeah. Cody, yeah. if you were pitching, I bet you I could do it. My brain says, <laughs> my brain says I can do it, but right. my body says no. Yeah. So I'm with you, I'll Cody. take it. Me too. Thanks, Cody. <laughs>